Hey, this is Jason with Everyday Apple, and I want to show you uh, in this short video how to do a screen share with a friend or family member where you're trying to give them some tech support, a little extra help with something that they can't seem to figure out on their Mac. And so it allows you to share their screen, see what they're seeing, and even take control of their screen and click around for them and maybe even just take care of the problem for them. Sometimes that's a lot easier than trying to talk somebody through an issue. And so maybe some of you have moms or dads out there who need a little bit of extra help. This is a great way to do that. All right, we're going to do this through messages. So you'll have a message thread open with the person you're trying to help. And the only prerequisite is that you have that you're logged into iCloud with messages. So that should be by default. But if you want to check, you've got your preferences there and you can go in and look and it should say enable messages in iCloud. So yeah, if you have any problems, you can check that, but that should be by default on both ends. So we've got our message thread with the person we're wanting to help. And we're going to click the little, little I button here. That's going to give us an option right in the middle there underneath the name of the person we're helping and it will say share. So click on share and you'll get a drop down that says ask to share screen. And so once you click that, they're going to get a message on their end. So let's switch to their screen here and you'll see in the upper right hand corner, it'll say, hey, they want to share your screen. And so they're obviously already aware we're doing this. <laughs> and uh, they're going to hover over that, click on options, and then accept. And when they click accept, they'll get another window because what we're wanting to do is control their screen and not just observe it. So by default, it should be set to control and they'll hit accept. So really easy. There, just click accept. And now once they click this, of course, they get a notification saying, oh, here's what's going on. They've got control of your computer now. And so back on my screen, I am looking at their Mac. And now I can help them with whatever they need. So, you know, just as a very simple example, <laughs> they maybe want to switch off of dark mode. I don't know how to turn off dark mode. What is this dark mode? So instead of trying to tell them, maybe you go in and you do it for them here. You open up preferences on their computer from where you are, and you say, well, I'm just going to click right here. And fortunately, when you do this, there's an audio call going on that's live. So they're hearing you talk through this as well, so you can talk through what you're doing. And so, you know, that can help. You can also be coaching them a little bit on something. So maybe next time they can do this for themselves. So really easy and just allows you to help out somebody in a very specific way. And uh, when you're ready to close this out and end the session, I mean, you're, you're basically running the screen sharing app. You can just go up to the upper left-hand corner of the screen and hit the red button to close out that window. That quits the whole screen sharing program and you're no longer in control of their computer once you do that. So hopefully that helps. Uh, it's really easy. Um, and again, if you both have an iCloud account and you both have a recent Mac computer, shouldn't be an issue at all. So. Uh, we'd love to hear your comments. Hit the like, subscribe button, all that good stuff. And it uh, always helps the channel. I appreciate you watching and see you next time. <laughs>